Hey guys, so I guess this will be like a vlog, right? Because there's not like a specific thing I want to talk about. But um, yeah, I just want to keep you guys uh, updated on the things that I do. Even though I don't record it, I still want to show it to you guys. Um, so yeah, I cleaned again. <laughs> and hopefully it lasts a little bit longer this time. But today, when I woke up, it was 58 outside. And I checked um, the temperature for the rest of the day. And it will not hit 80. We should stay... 76 and under so that means I should take advantage and do as much as I can outside today So that's what I'm doing. I did out of my shade cloth yesterday because um, the other day I was observing and Three o'clock um, this area was getting some strong Sun. So, you know, I had to do that To protect the plants just in case for the future. That's what that's for so it doesn't catch catch me off guard but yeah, um, so I just wanted to point out some things. There's so much replanting that I need to do. So many pots I need to address. I gotta get to that. Um, but yeah, I made this cute little wall decor. It's like a, like a, I don't know what you want to call it. A garden wall. And with um, the bamboo sticks. These bamboo sticks are the ones that they sell on for, to support for your plants they're really cheap they're like 2.98 i think and you get like six of them inside of a bag at walmart and they're about six feet tall so i was looking over here and i'm like hmm, i wonder if i can make something with them so i stuck i um pushed them down into the ground about a foot and then i took zip ties and zip tied um, more bamboo going this way so so far so good uh and then I got these cute little pots from the Dollar Tree. Very, you know, gardeny, And hung them there. I think I need to get three more just to go with the pattern. But I think they're super cute and they add a lot of color. And more room for more plants. At least for the propagations, you know, I can grow them in there. But, um, yeah, I think that that's super cute and it's a good idea. These little S hooks, I got them at Home Depot. It's four in a bag for a dollar eighteen, I think it was. So yeah, um, I got this one at Walmart the other day. Got this super cute planter um, from Dollar Tree. Super cute, and they had this one too. How cute! I have so much of these from um, the past animals that they've gotten that I need to pot up. I just need to do it. I just haven't gotten to it. So I need to do that. I need to repot this. I need to like, you know, I need to take whatever plants are salvageable from these things and just throw the baskets out because um, they're deteriorating. But yeah, that's it. Um, oh, I added more plants to this one because I was still um completing it there's still em some empty ones like that one and that one it's just that these here would be plants that do well in the shade so like a horthia and something that doesn't get tall so that's what i need to do for that and um here's a lizard shot he's just sleeping there he's been sleeping there for a while now <laughs> on the rock there's a rock there and then you know there's some nice breeze i lost it there you go see him right there Anyways, I, I think that these little planters are like houses for lizards because every time I'm moving one, there's a lizard that jumps out. I'm not afraid of them. I actually like the lizards. I used to play with them when I was younger in Puerto Rico. I used to um, get them to um, bite my ear and hang. They got no teeth, so it didn't hurt. It was just a pinch and they would just hang from my ears. So there you go. Fun fact. <laughs> uh, a lot of these plants for now are doing really well no rain we got rain one time and then that was it so i'm not worried about that uh, i just kind of keep an eye out if i want them to stay nice i normally don't water my plants but you know i've been looking at a lot of other people's plants and they, they do look nice and plump so i don't know i might start watering my plants it's just a lot of work guys can you imagine me trying to water everything and never get to it? And then I forget, did I water you last, I mean, the other day? And I'll start all over. So, I don't know. I'll think about it. Anyways. So, yeah. there There's still so many plants over there that I need to repot and address. Um, but, you know. 
taking it day by day when I can. I took advantage of the weather. Um, that table somebody threw out and it was perfect for me because I've been looking for a very easy table to move around. Um, when I'm working and I need shade, I can just move it anywhere where there is shade at that time. So that's why I picked that table. That is going to stay there, you know, that's like a decorative. So that stays put. But yeah, I need a little work table that I could just easily move around. Um, so I have my husband tie this um, metal rope or whatever you want to call it here so that I can have some hanging plants. This plant was sent to me by a, another fellow YouTuber. Um, her channel's in Spanish, but her plants are amazing. She lives in Oklahoma and man her plants look so beautiful but it's not only that they look beautiful they're they look prolific every single plant that she probably has is a full pot of the plant itself and I'm like how why do they look like this they look amazing but she does make her own soil and I think that that's the key she has um she uses worm casting in her soil I don't so I don't know. I want to use worm casting, but worm casting is not cheap, you know? Um, and yeah, this is already an expensive hobby in itself. And as you guys know, I am a stay at home mom. So I gotta, you know, do what I can, what I have. Anyways, I think that's it. Let me show you this pot over here because I'm loving it. Look at how pretty this is. Look at how these flowered they're they're so happy here i'm so happy that i decided to put these plants all together because now um i take care of them better because they're all in one place um so that's very helpful i don't know if i should start doing that more often it, um because it'll be easier for me too so yeah i think i'm gonna start doing things like that but yeah i'm really proud of this arrangement and um that one is doing really nice she will need to be repotted that's a very tiny pot where she's in but that's it guys thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to comment like and subscribe you guys have a blessed day bye guys